no person shall be allowed in the cordoned area other than the banksmen and helpers. No person shall be allowed on the trailer and on the crane while loading and offloading. Safety barrication should be secured in the working area around the crane. Land should be even and hard. Outrigger should be fully extended. Lights and sounds of reverse brakes should be in proper working condition. Rear view mirror should be clean and should be in a proper position. If the crane has to be placed near the excavation, then make sure that jack plate is at a safe distance from the edge, that is, three times away from the excavation depth. While lifting the weight, the hook should be right over the center of gravity. If this rule is not applied, then the weight will get lifted in a tilted position instead of a straight position. In such cases, the sling will have unnecessary weight and the load may become imbalanced, which is dangerous. This kind of problem must be rectified immediately. If the angle of sling triangle is bigger, it will create more pressure on the sling. This will reduce the capacity of the lifting weight. Make sure that the angle of the sling triangle is smaller, which will increase the capacity of lifting weight and is a safe condition. Lifted weight should be properly tied up by the guide rope so that it does not hit any person or object. Do not use equipment in any extraordinary and adverse conditions such as strong wind, heavy rain, heavy dust, thick fog, etc. Don't use cell phones or other electronic devices like music player, headphones, etc. while operating the cranes. If you consume alcohol or drugs, then do not conduct any lifting operation. While maintaining the equipment, make sure to turn the engine off. Take the keys out. Use wheel chokes and support the hydrolocks with a hard object. When the crane is not operating, then the operator should lock the cabin and place the key in a safe, authorized place. Remember, you are empowered and obligated to stop if any unsafe action or condition is observed. Report unsafe actions and unsafe conditions to your supervisor or safety advisor.